Hello crafty friends, welcome to my channel, welcome, well, or welcome back. Um, I was at a retreat this past weekend, and as I'm unpacking and getting stuff put away, I said, oh, I need to do a video. So if you wanna stick around and see what uh, the projects that I created and that um, we made, uh, grab a cup of tea, coffee, your favorite drink, maybe a little snack. I don't know how long this video is going to be. I'm going to try to be quick about it um, because I have tons of things I need to do, but I need to clear off my desk before I can start um, working on um, some other design team project stuff. But I had tons of fun. I was able to meet um, a new crafty friend, Meliza. If you have not seen my Instagram poster stories, we actually both attended the retreat. And thanks to Raquel, who is a Crafty Diva creation, she's the one that uh, invited us to the retreat for Stamp Anything. And we didn't know anything about, I didn't know anything about this retreat or about Stamp Anything until Raquel invited uh, us to this retreat. I think they had both attended our virtual retreat, was which, which was a Powerpuff Girl retreat. But I was like, oh no, I'm, I'm not interested in the Powerpuff. But when they told me about the retreat for October in Orlando, I was like, yes, sign me up. I want to go. So I signed up for it. It was in Orlando. Uh, in Florida. So that was a lot of fun. Uh, it was in a hotel in a conference room, uh, maybe like 40, 50 of us. Uh, and the instructors were amazing. I got to meet Annie with Stam Anything. And Stephen was one of the um, instructors on the coloring Copic, coloring, Co coloring Copic techniques instructors and Annie as well. Um, so much fun. So inviting. Um, it was a lot of fun. Um, and just tons of like door prizes and games. And uh, it was all day and in the afternoon we had like a pajama party and just everyone was just super sweet. And there was even a like a pop-up shop. So let me show you the items that that um, that were on our desk when we first got there. There was a couple of these boxes called Pizza Planet boxes. Um, I'm not sure who created what, but there were different items in there. And so I just use these boxes when I travel back to um, save some of the things that uh, we received. So one of the boxes that day had a little strawberry with my initial. Uh, our original box that had our stamps and projects had um, this cow print um, tag on it with my initial and my name. I was like, oh, got to keep that. Y'all know I love cow print and I love Toy Story. And this was on our desk the first day that we got there that had our... Um, projects that we were working on and so these were the cards that we worked on that day and I saved that that was super fun everything was just gorgeous uh how everything was set up this was a uh, pin that we were that we wore stamper share of Wendy then I received uh another one that said deputy Wendy and then star cadet star commander 2024 and then each of the projects were wrapped up in Toy Story um, little charms on each thing. So we've got Bullseye, we have the little Porcupine, and the little Pig Go Ham. And so I saved uh, a few of those. So that was neat to have. Everything was just so beautifully decorated and just had so many just amazing details. Um, in there also was this little trinket that had like little um play boxes that had um all the little blocks that had our name on it so that was fun uh then the next day we had slinky and it had a candy and you can take it out and then it just kind of lays flat where you can ha and so this was on our desk so we could eat a um uh, eat a little sweet treat so i thought that was neat i think this was made like on a laser on a laser cutter but in transit when I was traveling in my backpack in my backpack I kind of like smushed it in travel but I think I'm going to fix that with some glue so that was also on our desk um that was fun and then the second box that we received um or that we got was they had some different shaker bits uh and so I got these shaker bits so I just wanted to share that with you as well. Those were given to us if we wanted any of those shaker bets. 
So that was a lot of fun. And then there was a, a pop-up shop with some items for us to purchase. And so I did purchase a few things and then I'll show you the items that were actually um, included in the retreat with the projects that we made. Okay, so I picked up the open box villains. So these are all of the stamps that I picked up at her shop. So they're all of the different villains, Disney villains. Super fun. I don't know if you can see that. I probably need to put that behind a, a white piece of paper, but you get the gist of it. So yeah, so I bought that. Super, super fun. Oh, I can't wait to color these. I did pick up the Coco. So here is the um, Stamp Anything. That's who uh, creates these stampanything.com. So if you're interested, so I picked up this one because it was Disney and Coco. I love, love, love this. And here are the stamps to color. Super fun, huh? I love it. I love it. this is perfect for Dia de los Muertos, which is coming up in a few days. So I definitely need to color that and make a cute project. Um, I picked up the Your Classic. It's like a little retro uh, retro girl, and it had the die. These were on sale, so I got this because it was on sale. Then the little cow print stamp. Pick that up with the die as well. So, yeah, so th these came with the dies. These were on sale, so I picked up those. And then a little greeting alien. I picked up Take a Chance with the little dice. I thought she was super cute. And then, and that was all I got from her shop. Um, okay, so that's what I got from her shop. And then let me show you the projects that we created. So here is another Pizza Planet box. It was also really fun too, because we had pizza one day for lunch. Uh, so breakfast and lunch were included with the retreat. So that was, that was very nice. Uh, so one day we had pizza and just everything was just super, super fun. Just the theme was amazing. Um, so let me take the stuff out of the box so we can take a look at that. Okay, so we got some shaker bits in here. Now on the last day, we didn't go to the retreat because we ended up um, going to a theme park, but this was one of the projects that I still need to make uh, with Barrel of Monkey, so I need to make that. And they also supplied a package of paper to make different cards. Um, they provided us with some shaker pouches if we wanted to uh, make our, any of our cards into shakers. And this was a craft story retreat and that was also in our uh, box and this was the last project bullseye that was i colored that i have not put the card together because this was for the last day and so Eliza and i just worked on this on the last day so colored the bullseye just need to make the card then <clears throat> there's a card that we're going to make and we colored the little pig and it says go ham so we'll add that to uh our card and let me see so on the first day let's see which one okay so on the first day these were the projects that we created with the the stamps so we colored woody and it had a little action sketch and we added um we added it to the card, says you've got a friend in me, and we colored him up. And we also learned a new technique to make his jeans kind of look like denim. Super fun technique. Love that, love, 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 love that. So we got to learn a lot of different new little techniques and we uh, colored in his vest and we used colors to make his shirt plaid. Uh, I'm still learning uh, how to do different shading. So that was fun. Then this was the second card that we made with Miss Boo Peep and her little, little, the little sheep. And this actually turns on like a little light. So that was fun to be able to add that little light to that. So yeah, so this was the second card that we made. Um, we made T-Rex 
and turned him into a, a card. So we got to color him and we learned how to make the little blocks and do all the different shading and coloring. Then we did a paper piercing, paper piecing with uh, Mr. and Mrs. Potato Head from Toy Story. So that was fun. And we also got shirts that said Craft Story 5, Stamp Anything Craft Story. Love, love, love the shirts that we got. And then um, these were the different uh, colors that we use, our Copic coloring um, little mats that they gave us so we knew what colors to use, which was a lot of fun. Yeah, so those were the first cards that we made. That was a lot of fun. And then on day two, they gave us um, an itinerary of what we were going to be working on that day. And they gave us, oh, this was for the last day. These are the ones that we didn't uh, complete, but we did, I did color, uh, I did color them. Uh, here's the card that I colored, Zurge's Power with the little batteries. And here's the little Z Fold card. I just need to attach, I put the little things there, but I didn't take them off, but I need to put them on here. So we colored him and then we got like the little page that shows us what colors to use. This was a little tag that they gave us with day two projects. And it is Buzz's. So yeah, so I like that. Looks like a little receipt. Looks like Pizza Planet's receipt. And then we made um, an interactive card with the claw and this goes up and down and we actually colored all of the aliens in there and we made that card it made it super fun and then this is my favorite which was buzz oh my gosh i love how he came out so we learned all the different techniques and shading and the colors to use and then we turned it into a shaker oh my gosh this was super fun i just love 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 how he turned out I'm just like, oh, I colored that. You did that, Wendy. You colored that. So yeah, that was super fun to be able to learn how to what colors and what techniques to use uh, for coloring. And my my ink up here kind of blotched out, but that's okay. I just figured I can always stamp him up and do it again. Um, and then we made little mini note cards. And so we've got Woody and Rex, Zerg, Buzz, Ham, Forky, Bo Peep. Lotso and the alien. So yeah, so that was day one, day two, and then of course, you know, we have not I have not finished up my day my day three, but I was working on coloring um some of those items that they gave us and I'll finish those projects. And here are the stamp sets that came with the retreat items. And again, these stamps are not sold to the public because they are exclusive for those that attended uh, the retreat. So here are the stamps uh, with Lotso and Andy and Bullseye and Forky. Super, super fun. So I'll be able to stamp those out and make more projects. And it did come with the dies as well. Then we have the Mr. and Mrs. Potato Head die set. Then we have the Here's the stamp set that we that one of the cards that we created with this stamp. So we got this stamp set with our with our kits. Look at Buzz, the little oh I love it the alien. That's my favorite. Oh love it. And this says to infinity and beyond. And then we have the uh, die set that goes with it. Then we got the Woody stamp set with Rex and Bo Peep and the penguin and um, Slinky. And here that is. Here's that stamp set. Love it, and the die set. So yeah, so much fun, so much fun. And we also got to spend a day in Disney World. Uh, so that was a lot of fun. <laughs> so, so much fun. I had a lot of fun. Very, 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 very impressed with how this retreat was put together. Thank Ra Raquel for inviting uh, Meliza and Becky and I. We had a lot of fun, learned and colored a lot. And I am super excited um, for the next retreat next year. 
and I just wanted to share with you all of the fun projects. The Toy Story thing was amazing because I love Buzz Lightyear. I love all things Disney. So yeah, let me know which one was your favorite um, project and I will catch you on the next crafty video. Thanks for watching guys. Talk to you later. Bye.